Hey guys, so I got this pretty wicked case for my camera, but before I get to that, I'm just gonna give you a little update on the Pentax 67 video. So I know it was supposed to be all out already, but here's the thing. I shipped my film off to Vancouver to get processed because there's no way to, no place to do it here in Kelowna and I haven't started doing it myself. So it was supposed to arrive last week, didn't arrive, didn't arrive yesterday. Finally, I just called the place. I'm like, hey, what's going on with my film? It was supposed to be here last week. And they said that the guy accidentally filed it in the pickup folder instead of shipping it out to me in Kelowna. So that's what the holdup is, but no hard feelings. Everybody makes mistakes, whatever. Uh, they said they're going to express ship it, so it should be here tomorrow. So you can expect that video out this Monday, as long as the film shows up. All right, so anyways, enough of that. Check out this cool case I got. All right, so I'll just show you how I got the case set up. I got my camera right over here, pops out, real easy. And here, let me show you this real quick too, actually. So I can show you how deep it is. So it's got two thick layers of foam there and then another layer up here. And you can kind of see where those little marks are. That's kind of where the top of the camera goes, but it's pretty thick. So I'm not too worried that it's gonna like, you know, damage the case, I mean the camera rather. Um, and then as you can see over here, I got a chop, chopped out two parts for my lenses. I got the uh, 160 right here, pretty cool. And then over here, I've got my 55. So yeah, it's nice peace of mind for travel, especially. I just close it and then throw it in the back of my car and then I don't gotta worry about it. So it's uh, money well spent, I think. All right, that's a wrap on the video, guys. So if you need a good travel case and you don't want to spend four or five hundred dollars on a Pelican, I'd suggest getting one of these. It's pretty good. It's made by Maximum. Uh, I don't know if you can get this in the U.S. or not, but uh, I'm sure if you're in the U.S. and you can't find it, you can just get it off of Canadian Tire All right, so come back Monday for the first shoot that I did with my Pentax 6-7. All right, see you guys.